Welcome back, guys, to episode... What what episode even is it, actually? Let me check. Episode 5 of um, the One Country Challenge. Um, and today I'm in a bit of a pickle. Um, because I'm meant to upload this today on Sunday. So I upload it every Sunday. And, yeah, usually I just pre-record it during the week. And, <clears throat> you know, find my time to edit it and stuff. And then I upload it on Sunday. Um, but yeah, this week I've had no time to do that, so I'm recording it on Sunday, I'm going to edit it and upload it all on Sunday, so <laughs> it's going to be a b busy day for me, hopefully, so I'm hoping, right, that this episode doesn't take me too long to record, hopefully I can get it done in like a couple of tries, but then the issue is that we have Bolivia and Botswana in today's episode, and that is not going to be easy. Um, so the thing with Bolivia is that I think Bolivia might be doable. Um, I know there's some people who know like all the coverage in Bolivia properly. I don't. So that's going to be, um, I guess, a drawback for me. I'll have to, I don't know. I, I, I still have a general idea, I think, but I'm by no means an expert in Bolivia. So <clears throat> we'll see how that goes. But Botswana, I'm really scared of because you have really long roads in Botswana with no signs. So... I don't know. Unless we get a good spawn every five rounds, um, it's, it might be hard. So <clears throat> let's see. Let's hope it goes well um, and that we can get it done in time. Um, so yeah, uh, it's it's been a good series so far. I feel like we've been doing pretty well so far. So hopefully uh, the streak continues. Um, and if you don't know how this thing works, this challenge works, then there should be a link to episode number zero somewhere above me, um, which should uh, it, it tell you all the rules and how this whole thing works and everything. So yeah, feel free to check it out. Um, and the playlist and that episode should also be linked in the description. So if you want to go and watch the previous episodes, you can do that there. But yeah, I think without any further ado, actually, let me move my cam up here. I forgot I do that for this episodes, these episodes. Maybe turn myself a little bit smarter. Okay. Um, so let's go. Without any further ado, the first country we have to do is Bolivia. I haven't played this map yet, um, so I wonder how this will go. Let's see. Use default settings um, and let's start. Attempt number one. Hopefully it's the final attempt. Okay, instantly I'm thinking like somewhere here on this road, Santa Cruz, next to Santa Cruz. Um, but it's not east-west, so maybe it's the wrong road. but. I'm thinking of this area. Let's go. Step number one. Gone past that sign already. That doesn't look useful though. Okay. Oh. Return. Okay. Step two. Three. Four. Five. <clears throat> okay. Six, seven, is there a, uh, maybe I should go for this, I'm going back, step eight, okay, Naranjal Don Bosco is to the south, okay, yeah, so I'll just go back to start, go the other way, one, is that useful? Contado Villarreal. Okay, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and oh, I go past that. Ah, I went past it. Okay. Um, can I actually just quickly look for Don Bosco place? 
do I have to zoom in more? Or could it even be further south, like here somewhere? Okay, I'm gonna go that way again and hopefully we can read that sign. Yeah, I've gone past it again. Oh. Does that just say Retorno? Maybe it's not a useful sign actually. Okay, so then something Don Bosco is the only thing I saw that could be useful. I don't know where that would be. But I'm pretty sure it's around this area. It's probably around Santa Cruz. I could just <clears throat> make a guess on Santa Cruz and see how far I am. You know, I'm going to try that. Okay, 3753, three. that's not bad. So was that not a place at all? Uh, I guess it wasn't. Um, okay, I can see Naran Hal here. All right, so that was hard to find anyway. Um, but that's fine, I think. 3753 three is not a bad start. Okay, is this just La Paz? Um, okay. Or like a suburb of La Paz, maybe. Three. It's like a big roundabout. Hmm. I don't know, but I think it could be. Okay, what does this say? Okay. The El Alto. Okay, so we are, yeah, we are just in El Alto. Okay, so that's pretty good. Could it be this? Estacion Plaza La Paz. Could that be this one? Let's go back to start. And I'm right. Wait, that is to my east. So I'm like here. Yeah, I think it is. So is this just a uh, 5k then? <laughs> Never mind. Okay, so it was this uh, this roundabout. All right. Um, okay, that's still fine. Oh, this is where it gets rough for me. Um, step one. Step two. Oh, I've just gone back. Step one. Step two. Step three. Step four. Step five. Six. <laughs> seven. Eight. Nine. 10. Okay, I'm not really hopeful of finding a sign here. So if I have to guess based on the landscape, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, okay, never mind, eight. Nine, ten. Okay, I don't really think I'm gonna get a sign here. Um, if I if I have to guess based on the landscape, I'm gonna say like this is like north of La Paz. But see, this is where being good at Bolivia helps because I am not sure of this at all. But I'll give it a shot. Oh, completely off. All right, go again. Attempt number one is a failure. All right, attempt number two. Um, where is this? Step one, two, Atlantida. Step number three, number four, um, five, six. Still not sure. Seven. Okay. 
8 Third of enter. No, I didn't mean to do that. 9 I don't know if the plates even help in Bolivia, do they? It says SFSX Okay, interesting. Go back to start. Let's go again. One, two, three. Dad. Four. Five, okay. <clears throat> Travel and tourism in Kavi Street, but they don't have the city name, which sucks. Oh, Potosi. Okay, that helps. Okay, um, I know where Potosi is. I I just don't know what the city looks like. Okay, that's good enough. Four nine five one. Oh, okay. We are on a bridge of some sort. Okay, let's go. Step number one. There's a couple of signs. Okay, that helps. Um, I'll take another step. I don't know any of these places, but I'm guessing they're findable. Uh, okay, there's Hua Nuni. And that is to my sort of northwest. And then the other one is Chocopatia. Wonder where that is. Maybe the river is not even a river, it's just a, I don't know, try to, hmm. Okay, well, I'm just going to guess and hope for the best because I'm by no means confident about this. Okay, that's not bad. So, okay, so there wasn't a river, <laughs> it's just a part of the road, okay. And then I still don't know where Chocopatia is. But okay, that's fine. That's I'll take that. Four seven four two. Okay, this again looks somewhere near. Oh wait, it says Cochabamba, really. But it's got to be like a bit further north of it, or like northeast of it. Um, Cochabamba. Opa. Wait, what does that say? Also, wait, I should look at this. Okay, I want to take one step here to see this. Puerto Vila Royal. There it is. So, are we here then? Um, the road angle doesn't really match, so maybe we are like here. That could actually be the 5k, let's try it. <laughs> okay, I sent it a bit too quick. Uh, I could have probably gotten that. I wanted to go for the pog. Okay, that's fine. 4370, not bad. We're on 14k, we're still on base. This looks maybe just like La Paz somewhere around, somewhere around it. Step one, two, three. Um, step four. <clears throat> step five. Six, seven, eight.
Um, okay, look at those mountains. They're snow capped. Nine. Mm. And ten. Australia. Okay, let's go back to start. A few moments later. Okay, I think I'm just gonna send it and hope for the best because I th I really think it's somewhere here. Um, and if I'm wrong, then I'll be sad. But okay, that's good enough. Four seven six four. And then last round. This looks doable, so I'm happy about that. Assemblea de Dio Boliviana. Okay, step one. Step two. Um, the El Torno. I have seen El Torno. Where is it though? I do remember seeing El Torno somewhere. But I can't really remember where. Is it a big place? Um, is there any other information here? The El Torno. Okay, that's all it says. Um, but it does ring a bell, so, oh, there it is. So I'll be just here. I don't want to rush it in case. Road angle seems to fit, so maybe we are just here. All right, let's go for it. Nice. Uh, that was not that bad, actually. I thought it could have taken longer to get this one. Um... But to be honest, it's uh, it's really not that bad. <clears throat> so Bolivia is done. It took me 13 minutes for this game, which is really not bad. Uh, and I could have probably reduced the time if I just sent this one earlier. Um, but that's, I'll take it, 23810. It did take me two attempts though. And 13, 13, that's a good number as well. All right, so let me do this style there we go so bolivia gold is done and we can move on to botswana so let's go straight into botswana and hope it doesn't take too long so here we go botswana Attempt number one. I haven't played this map yet either, so. But I do know that you get a lot of long roads with nothing around. But this looks like a bit of an urban place, so I am happy about that. Two seconds later. Does that just say Gaborone? I think it does. Should I just give it a shot and see how far I am? Oh, Serove, did I read that wrong? Maybe I did. Okay, so that's uh, attempt number one failed. And already after attempt number one, I have to make an appearance from the future. I think that might give you guys an idea on how Botswana might have gone. Um, but anyway, I'll be making a few appearances from now and hopefully I'll be able to commentate uh, whatever parts I'm speeding through now. So let's get started. Attempt number two. Um, I was spawned on a straight road. Um, I saw a sign there. I thought it might be useful, but I zoomed in. It was like completely white. It was really hard to read anything on that. So that was not useful. I traveled further, hoping there'd be something at least, but there was, <laughs> there was literally nothing, which is what I was afraid of in Botswana. So I made a guess no moving based on the road angle and I was pretty far off. And then I went ahead for attempt number three, and we had a similar story. Uh, so I did find a couple of signs, uh, to be fair, but unfortunately, none of them had any any sort of information. The only thing it said was Botswana on them, which <laughs> really doesn't help when you're playing the map of Botswana. Um, but I did find this one green sign as well, but the issue with that sign was that it was completely faded out. So I made a no moving guess again, and it, it, this time it wasn't too bad. I got 3000 points, so I continued. Um, it was still possible to get a gold, but unfortunately, even on this spawn, I didn't really have any sort of signs 
So I just had to make a no moving guess and I was far off again. But after that, I actually had a very good round. So here we go. We keep going. Attempt number four, I think. Okay, we're back in an urban place. I'll try not to throw this time. Okay, step one. Um, we have a showroom of sorts. Step two. Step three. Step four. Interesting. Uh, step five. Step six. Okay, surely there's something here. No. Step seven. Okay, so it's like a bus station. N Swazwa Mall. I think this is step eight. Okay, there's a spa as well. Step nine. Surely this is just like Gabaron, right? Oh no. I think this is step 10. There's a pawn shop. Um, okay, so let's see if I can find like that mall. Station was it somewhere here? KP Mall. Okay, I'm not really sure in this one. <sighs> okay, let's go back to start. Mm. Step one. Um, step two. Step three. Step four. Five. Six. Okay, so this is not a useful step number one. Okay, we have Hino. Oh, it said Francis Town. All. Oh my God, I've wasted so much time looking for this. <laughs> it said Francis Town right there. Okay, well that helps. Um, so it's here, and then where is this Hino showroom? Because <clears throat> I'm pretty sure we went like here and. Yeah, and then we saw the station and went, yeah, so I, th I think we started somewhere here. Toyota service station, okay. This is not Toyota, is it? Oh, it is Toyota. Oh, okay. So then are we just, did we just start here? Oh, we have street names actually. Seboba. Yeah, there we are. Okay, so. Wait. Oh, it's on the other one. Okay, so 4995, I'll take it. And after that great round one, I had a round two where I was spawned again on a long road. But fortunately, I had a sign, or so I thought. Um, but that was the only sign I could find. Um, and. It, it had something like Maga Garapa written on it. So I searched for it a bit. I traveled around to see if there's um, maybe another sign I could find, but there wasn't. So I just had to search for that one little place. And yeah, I searched the whole country. I, I feel like basically <laughs> took me a while, but in the end I still couldn't find it. So I just guessed uh, randomly based on the road angle and I was not really close. So that was a failure to 
what an attempt that started off decently at least and then i moved on to the next attempt again it was not a good attempt as you can see i just spawned on a long road with no signs nothing <clears throat> so i made a no moving guess and again i was not close enough um and then this attempt was actually interesting because i did find a sign um which said Mound on it, which is a city I know of. So I, I, I thought it might be somewhere around Mound, not exactly in it, but I just guessed in Mound so that I'd be close anyway. But it turns out there was nowhere near Mound. Um, <laughs> but even so, after that, there was an insane game. So here you go, you can have a look at that game. Gosh, this is horrible. How many attempts? I've, I've lost count of how many attempts to spin. Step one, step two, step three, step four, five. It's really hard to find intersections as well in Botswana. Six, step seven, step eight, step nine and ten. <laughs> oh my gosh. Step one, two, three, four. Oh, five. Okay, Lobatsi to the north. I don't know where that is, but we can look for it. Okay, Lobatsi is here, and then M. Matete is here. So, are we on this road? Um, yeah, I think that is this intersection. So we are a bit further south of that. Um, let's see. Step number one, two, okay. Wondering where this intersection is. Oh, it might be that actually. So maybe we are a bit further north of it. <sighs> All right, 4996. That's not bad. But can we keep it up though? Step number one, step number two, step number three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10. Oh my god, this is really hard. Step number 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. Oh my gosh, not a single sign in sight. I think this might be it. I think I might like have to settle for a bronze on this one. Um, I'm, I want to say this is like Eastern or Western, I mean, but I don't know. This is really bad, really, really bad. Um, almost not south though. Or could it be like really east? I don't think so. I think this is more western for some reason. Let's try this. Oh my god. What? No way. That is so lucky. <laughs> I did think it was western because of how white the soil was. And then I was just finding a patch of road with the right angle. Oh my god, okay, we're still in it, we're still in it. Now, I just need signs, please. I can't do those insane guesses every round. Okay, step one. Step two. Step three were really bad, but I can't go further. Okay, so. Coverage ends to the north. Step one. Wait, it ends to the south? What? No, don't do this to me. Step one. To, oh my god. Why? Mm. 
No way. Not after that insane guess. I don't know where this is. Step one. I don't see a single building. Step two. Can I somehow break through this? Step three. No, I just went backwards. Step one. Okay. Wait. Come on, please let me like break through this somehow. Oh my gosh. This is it, guys. This is it. <laughs> I don't believe this. I've literally gotten spawned in a place where I can't move. Oh my god. This is just it. I, I can't do anything. Step three, four, and yeah, that's it. <sighs> what do we do? What's the plan? I can't move. Yep, I've tried enough. I think I might just go for it and settle for a bronze. Let's go here somewhere. Okay, 1300 could have been worse. Ah, uh, okay, so that makes sense why the coverage is broken there. Okay. Alright, let's see how much I can get on this attempt at least. Step 1, Step 2, Step 3, Step 4, Step 5, Step 6, Step 7, 8, 9. Was that a sign? It's just Chevron, okay. But I mean, I don't think it was really helpful. Okay, let's go this way. Step one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. That is bad. That is really bad. Step one, step two, step three. Step four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. All right, this is really, really bad. <clears throat> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 8, 9, 10. Okay, this is... Um, I don't know what to do here. The angle is like this. So should I just go close to Cabaron again? And hope for the best. <laughs> Let's see. Oh my god. Actually, it was kind of white, wasn't it? The soil. I should have thought of that. Let's finish one game at least. I've not finished a single game yet. Step one, step two, step three, step four. I just want to see if I can get silver at least. Step five, step six, step seven, eight, nine, and ten. Okay. <sighs> step one, step two, three. Why is it so hard to find a sign in Botswana? Step 4, Step 5, Step 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. <laughs> I don't know what to do. I've, I've, I've got nothing. Yet again. See, the soil here is kind of red, so I'm going to go this time closer to Botswana. I mean, to Gaborone. Okay, 2081. That's enough for a bronze. So 13452 is the best we've got so far. And I'm almost an hour into the recording, so I'll keep going. I'll keep going. And here I am, back from the future. I did keep going indeed, and I did have a couple of decent games. So let's let's go through them. Let's walk through them. Um, on this one, round one, I thought there was going to be no sign. Um, 
so I just sent it and it wasn't close enough so I just had to reset but then the next round I did find a sign and it said um, I actually don't remember what it said but you can you can see it on the screen I found two signs and they both gave me pretty much the exact area where I was meant to be um, I found a little off-road um, and I thought I had the 5k um, so I sent it I was a little bit further off but that was good enough to keep going <clears throat> round number two another long road another uh, another another round where I'm just hoping to find a sign uh, I found a couple of rest areas so I thought there might be a sign around me somewhere unfortunately though even after going both ways 10 steps I did not find a single sign so I just had to guess it based on the road angle but fortunately it wasn't actually too bad this time I got like a 4.3k there so that was good and then round three I did find a sign um, and I think it said something Mapeno Cattle Ranch or something like that. So I was wondering if Mapeno might be a place. I moved around to see if this, there could be another sign that might help, but not quite. I was two rounds in. I was still going for the gold. So I, I still kept searching. I still kept searching. I thought I'd get something at least. Um, but unfortunately, uh, I I couldn't find Mapeno even after searching a lot. So. I had to give up on this round and I just had to make a guess randomly based on uh, well I guess just like a no moving guess and I, I guessed on the completely wrong side of the country so <laughs> that that attempt was not really good but I, I thought I might as well try to get a silver because getting a gold start to seem really really hard at this point so it really became a quest for silver at this point so again on this round i had no signs nothing so i just had to make a random guess and it wasn't really that close on this round again a very very dry part of botswana not like botswana isn't dry to begin with but um yeah i couldn't find anything and i was far off so i had to go again and on this round i spawned in an urban location so i was hopeful i was hopeful that i could get it um, and i found a sign that said francistown so I knew we were in Francistown. After that, it was just a matter of finding the intersection and ultimately I found it. And I, uh, I think I also 5 k this, yes. And on the next round, again, there was no sign. But this time, interestingly enough, the, the there was an intersection, although there was no sign. So that helps. And then the angle of the intersection and how the road curved, I thought that I had a fetch fair, fairly good chance of finding this just based on the road angle and how the road curves. So I scanned for multiple roads throughout the country. It took me quite a long time. Um, so I, yeah, I just kept scanning, hoping that I'd find something that matches. Um, I found a couple of things that somewhat fit, but didn't really match. Uh, but yeah, I kept looking over and over and over and ultimately I couldn't really find something that exactly fit. So I had my marker on a intersection that did somewhat fit. I, I guess it's not really that intersection. It took me quite a long time as you can see. I'm still scanning. I'm, I think I'm scanning mainly like the western part of the country because of how, like the, how wide the soil is. Um, but yeah, I, I scanned a lot of places, but in the end, I couldn't find an exact fit. So I went for, yeah, that intersection, which I thought fit at least somewhat well. Um, uh, yeah, for, for just, just because I couldn't find anything better, I went for it. And it turns out that it was even further south than I went. And it actually was just two white roads that were intersecting. So it would have been really, really hard to find that. Um, but I still kept going, even though I had lost the chance to get a gold because uh, a silver was still possible. And luckily on this round, I had two signs, um, one to Cabarone and another one to Ribete, I think. So uh, they were both equidistant. So I just made a guess in the middle and I got a decent score. But unfortunately, on round four, again, 
I was on a, a dirt road with really no signs, really no hope of finding a sign either. So I just had to make a random guess. And yeah, it, it really wasn't that good, was it? Um, so here I am again. I need like a 3k to get a silver medal, but I couldn't really do so. Um, but then this game happened. Will this be the first bronze in this list? That's the question now. Okay, like this is what I like to see, right? This is the first time we've actually gotten like a useful sign. Um, this is what I was hoping for to start off with. Um, but we've clearly not had that kind of luck. Okay, step one, step two. So, Komana is here, okay. But I can't tell how far that is. Is that 314 or is that like 34? Okay, it's just 34. So, 34 from Komana. And there's like a road going to the south where we spawned. Um... One, two, wait, three. Okay, and then Sehitwa is 29. <clears throat> okay, so did we spawn here then? I think that is it. Let's give it a shot. All right, nice. So we're starting with the 5K again. Okay, I think I've seen this road enough to think that there is this road, but let's see. Come on. Step one, two, three, wait, four, five. Oh, come on. Wait, is that? Okay, never mind. Is, okay, was that? Kukalkari. Mabua Sehope. Okay, that's a really long name. I would like it if I could read the whole thing though. Something Park. Okay, Trans Frontier Park. I wonder what that means. Oh, there it is, actually. Wait. Wait, uh, what? That is to my north? Wait, is this actually in Namibia? Or I mean South Africa? Is this like a spill coverage? Wait, let's go back to start. There is a road like going north of me. Oh, so are we on this white road? Nah, but it's got to be a yellow road, though. Okay, this is interesting. Okay, let's go step one, step two, step three, four, five. Oh, wait, six. Okay, 820. Okay, wait, 820. Okay, this is 820, actually, so never mind. So A20, oh, so maybe it's this road that goes there, right? So if you want to go here, how do you get to it? Okay, we'll, we'll think about that. Uh, and then we have Sekorna and Kakia, 80, Sekoma and Kakia, 80 and 30. Um, <clears throat> don't see either of them. Oh, Kakia's here. Okay, so <sighs> Kakia is 30 to the north. Hmm. 
There's a road that goes this way. Does this go all the way to that park? It's gone up now. I'm gonna follow this road and see <laughs> if it actually goes to the park. Okay, so it goes here and then does this road go to the park? Not ready, okay. <clears throat> I am confused why there is a sign. To the reserve or whatever. Um, but we have signs, so we have something to work with. So the road angle is like this, so... Yeah, it's probably like this part of the road, maybe. Or is there a part of the road where there's like a parallel road? It's got to be somewhere here. Okay, so... I think it might actually be... Like this part of the road. Yeah. Okay. Um, I'm just going to go for it. Never mind. It is here. So was it really? Okay. Well, 4404 is not that bad. Um, let's see. Step 1, 2, 3, 4, 5... Six, seven, eight, nine, <clears throat> ten. <laughs> oh my god. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh. Oh, there's a sign. Okay, Orapa is straight. <clears throat> and Leti Hakane. Okay, Orapa and... Okay, Orapa and... Let... Yeah, so... They're both straight. And then the mine is... To the east. Now, the question is, where is the mine? There's the mine. Okay, so this got to be the mine road that splits off here. Definitely. Yep. Okay, so this is fine. And then we started like a bit before the curve. So yeah, this is like straight. More or less. Like here, maybe. 4992. Nice. Alright, this looks bad again. Step one, step two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Hmm. And then, <sighs> interesting. Okay, let's go to the north. Step one, step two, step three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh no, we had such a good run as well so far. We're on 14, 3, 9, 6. I need one of those insane guesses right now. Ooh. Go back to start. What is this actually? Mm, probably not useful. Yeah, I don't know. Um, let's go south again. 1, 2. Oh, wait, wait, wait. One, 
two, three, four, <clears throat> five, six, seven. Nope, nothing on the truck. This is bad. <laughs> this is really bad. Step one, step two, step three, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. All right, I need a plan. Road angle is like that. So could we be on this road? I think we very well could be. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, and the road like curves a bit that way. Um I don't know. Where do I go? Because it very well could be like here or further even. <laughs> oh no, I hate this. I hate this so much. Why is there not a single sign anywhere? Should I just go for this? I mean, I have no guarantee that it's on this road. It very well could be on this road or just somewhere else completely. I'm, I think I'm just going to go for it. If not, we'll try for a silver, I guess. It is that road. Okay, so Kang is really close and you're really telling me there's not a single sign to Kang even. Oh my gosh, that is so unlucky. Okay, well, at least we've made it to silver. We are on 15k. Um, we could maybe get to a 20k here because we are in an urban location. Wow, if only there was a sign to that place there, we could have gotten a gold here. Alright, step one. Step two. Starts with an M. Um, I mean, I'm confident I'll get this one. It's not like it's going to change my medal or anything, but it'll give a decent score, I guess. Kwai Development Trust. There's a place called Kwai. I'm not sure. Scenic Flights. Southern Africa. Natalie Center. Um, I don't know. I don't know what the city is. A few moments later. Marlborough. It does say Gaborone there, but it says a lot of cities. Um, oh, it says Mound. Okay. <clears throat> so, are we by the Mound Airport? I think we are. Um, let's go a bit here. Kalahari, yeah. I think that's here, right? Okay, so that should be good enough. Okay, it's here. Um, 4983, 20079 is the best we've got. I think I'm going to give up on this run and accept a silver for now because it's really seed dependent, I feel like, getting getting a 25k in Botswana. We got a silver, I'm happy with that, but 
I really wish we got a gold. So I wouldn't have to do this again later on. But it is what it is. 20.079 is the furthest we got. 17.12 is the time. And this is a silver. So it's the second silver we've gotten. Wait, is this a wrong accent? My eyes can't even tell. I think it's just here. Okay. Anyway, so let's see how many attempts that was. I swear that was a lot of attempts. Um, so if I go to activities. <clears throat> 20. Okay, so I've completed one, two, three, four games of Botswana. If I go to ongoing games, I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yes, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven ongoing games and one, two, three, four completed games. That's 11 attempts. That's the highest number of attempts I've ever had. Oh my God, we've actually crossed double digits in the attempts. Um, but at least we crossed 20k somehow. I'll take that. Um, 22.5k though. We're going to need a good seed for it. Um, but as I mentioned earlier, I will be attempting um, the countries which I couldn't get a gold on later on. Um, I'll just dedicate like one episode to each country so that I can get multiple tries in. Hope for a good seed. Um, so Argentina will be one of them. Botswana will be one of them. And who knows, we might have multiple in the future. Brazil could be one of them. Brazil is coming up next and that is going to be a hard one. So Brazil could be one of those. Um, Cambodia, I feel like it's definitely going to be one of them. Cambodia is one of the hardest, I think. Um, and I, I don't know, there's going to be a lot of countries still to go. <clears throat> so we might have more of them. <clears throat> Um, but yeah, uh, that's it for today's episode. As you can tell, my voice is dead. Let me drink some water. <clears throat> so yeah, <clears throat> I'm dying. My voice is dying. Um, I think that's where I call it. Botswana has killed my voice. And that was a good attempt. That was a good run. And now it's going to be a lot of work editing this for me, so... Um, anyway, thank you all for watching. Hope you had fun and let me know how you're doing if you're also playing along and I will see you guys next time.